And now, First Warm 5 weather. Good Sunday morning, folks. Well, today is a horse of a different color from yesterday. Yesterday, kind of gloomy in some places, but today, those showers have since moved out. That cloud cover has moved out, and so we have mostly cloud or mostly sunny skies, partly cloudy skies for the rest of the day. Now, as that happens, we start to heat up. It's 77 in Rio Grande City, 79 in McAllen, 81 in Edinburgh, and then the upper 70s, low 80s toward the coast. Now, because we don't have all that cloud cover, we're going to continue to heat up, and we heat up fast. From 10 a.m., we're in the upper 70s, but then by 1 p.m., we're in the upper 80s, almost a 10 degree temperature difference, high of around 90 by around 3 p.m., only cooling down to around 89 by 4 p.m., and then by 7, cooling down to around 83, mostly sunny skies. So those clouds will continue to decrease as the day goes along. And dew points, this is what the cold front really did, it's, it lowered our dew points. So yesterday we were climbing to the very top of that very humid category. Well, we're on the edge of that muggy and very humid category right now. We're going to continue to drop in dew points as the day goes along. We're mainly dry today. We had a couple of showers really early this morning, late last night. Then we're dry tomorrow, dry on Tuesday. And because we don't have those rain chances, it's a pretty decent day to be on the water. Your winds will be out in the northeast at 5 to 10 knots. There are no advisors. The next tide is a high tide at 11.30 a.m. and your seas are at 2 to 4 feet. So we have storm fury going on today from noon to 4 at the Far Event Center. So go out there and meet some of the te weather team and meet Chief Meteorologist Tim Smith. Today high of around 90 degrees, mostly sunny, comfortable humidity. Winds out of the northeast at around 5 to 10 miles per hour. Tonight cooling down to only 63, mostly clear early on, and then patchy fog is possible later on because those winds are so light. Now we go on a little bit of a heating trend, and if you don't like temperatures in the 90s, well, you're not going to like the seven-day forecast because we hit 92 on Monday, and then we stay in the 90s until we go on a big heating trend from Wednesday on to Saturday. We're going to continue tracking those temperatures for you, and that's your first Warren 5 forecast. Frank?